Hello guys, welcome to COT. Today we will be learning how you can get your AWS Educate getting started with storage batch. It's completely free and anyone can earn this batch. Even uh, the beginner and crowd can earn this batch and it's very much easy. And today I will be showing you how to get it done. So first, you have to just go to this AWS Educate page. The link will be in the description or you can just search AWS Educate. If you are a new user, click on register now. If you already have an account in AWS Educate, click on sign in to AWS Educate. Once you click on it, it will be redirected to another page. As I already have an account, uh, it will ask you to sign in. You can, if you are not a member, AWS Educate member, you can apply now. So sign in with your password and email. So you will be redirected to this page. Once coming to over here, you can choose this getting started with storage lab one. As you know, AWS is a leading market cloud manager, cloud uh, in the in the banking in all the sectors in clouds, AWS has a very good stand. So this is a very good boost to your resume which will be uploaded and it's very much easy and there is no prior knowledge which is required to earn this. You can uh, start with the course very much easily. So as you know, it starts with getting started with the storage. Uh, all the courses, which all the things which you might need, have been displayed in this. So you can go through all this. What are the objectives? What are the layout? How it will be done? And what are the learning path? And then you can come to modules so that you can know what are all the modules which you have to do. So in this, there are only a few steps which you will need to complete to get your badge. So first, you have to complete a pre-course survey regarding AWS. Then you will be you will be made to learn about AWS, the different storage classes in AWS, and then a hands-on lab experience by AWS, so that you can get you can make use of the knowledge which you have learned through the, uh, the videos which they teach you, and then it's the final assessment. So this is very much important uh, when you come the final assessment. <clears throat> getting started with storage, uh, it's a score which you have to get minimum 70 of 100 points to get your certificate. Once you complete all this, right, you can see that if you click on each one, it's going to redirect you to that particular material. So we can see here, it, it is getting loaded. So it is getting started with storage. Uh, AWS uh, the educate page is a little bit slow, so it takes time to load in because there is a large amount of data and the video to be loaded in so it takes a little bit of time so as I have already completed its coming resume you can just restart or you can it will start first for you so if you can see it will start like this so here don't click on this next option please click on continue over here so that it just automatically Welcome goes to the next one once you are completely done with all this then click on the next one so that you can go to the next module so each module there is a continue button over here so that you can continue for each one so in this entire session they will help you to understand what is cloud computing why the different storage classes of aws which provides the pricing of aws like what's the price you have to pay for the type of data or the type of storage you want so it is very much necessary for the future as every uh, type of uh, what every type of employee or every type of company is going to move all its details to the clouds. So having a basic knowledge about cloud and storage of cloud is very much necessary. It may be from any background, like you, it is not only for CS or it's not only for IT sector. It can be from any background or it can be even from a commerce kind of background so that you can keep check of all the things. So storage is very much important. So I hope that everyone registers for this course and there are a lot of courses which you can also do in this particular AWS Educate. So all of this are free but a few does not give you a badge but you will get all the knowledge and experience which is required for your future and you can improve your skill set to a whole new level if you complete all the courses. There are different courses upon what you need like you can just go through these like there are analytics, cloud computing, development, machine learning and a lot. You can even filter out many of them by if you are a beginner there is foundational level then intermediate and then advanced level courses. So you can go to the website and uh, this is a very useful page for everyone you can start your cloud journey over here and uh, another perk of this is AWS is if you complete a few badges and AWS recognizes it 
you can be a part of the AWS uh, community. They are going to send you an invite letter, which would be uh, the community is very uh, helpful. I will just show you the invite letter as well. The invite letter is for students who have completed. Uh, it's not specifically for anyone. Like uh, the AWS itself sends it to persons who has completed a few badges or has been very much active in the AWS community. So this is the. In the AWS Educate community, there are there is like so many perks you'll be getting. You'll be exposed to a lot of people, which will be very helpful in building your skills and acquiring a lot of knowledge. This is called AWS Emerging Talent Community. So it is a community where uh, you get an invite once you have completed a few courses and you have been very much active in the AWS Educate system. So it is a very helpful page where you can exchange a lot of knowledge and gain a lot of knowledge and skills and get to meet new people who have same interest in you. So this would be the invite letter which I had got recently. Yeah. So it shows as a recent badge earner from AWS Educate, we are very thrilled to invite you to the AWS Emerging Talent Community. So these are the perks which you'll be getting once you complete a few courses in this and be a little bit active in the AWS Educate and there are a lot of AWS plans which you can go through and I'll be sharing a lot of them uh, through in the future videos so please subscribe and like and share the videos with your friends and the recent, uh, there's a new video coming up short which is about uh, how you can play a game and get your AWS Cloud Partitioner badge it is AWS Cloud Partitioner Partitioner is a very important badge. It like it showcases that you are a uh, well educated and well educated with cloud services regarding a AWS. You can host a website. You can uh, you are capable enough to host websites. You have the knowledge to help others regarding AWS and cloud par partitioner is very much important and it brings in a lot of uh, skills which needed in the resume also. And if you add it to your resume, it's very much. Uh, it increases your skill set to whole new level if you know AWS Partition. So thank you guys, please subscribe, like and share the channel with your friends. Thank you.